Hello friends in this video we are going to see how to search HTML table data by using simple jQuery code without page refresh. Here we will not use any Ajax method for search data from server side but we WLL use pure jQuery code for search HTML table data. Here we write jQuery code for search text from HTML table and based on that it will filter HTML table row and figure out searching text available in any of the table cells if search query available in any of the table cell then it will display that table row on web page. This is my index.php page in which we have load employee table data from my SQL table and display on this page in HTML table format. In this table we have a did attribute is equal to employee table. We will use the sid as selector in jQuery code for searching query from this HTML table. From this table after searching query, it will display only those table row in which search text is available. Let us start writing code for filter HTML table data by using jQuery, so for this first we have write input type is equal to text with attribute name is equal to search it is equal to search. We will enter search query into this text box and from HTML table it will display match table row from HTML table. Now we have moved to write jQuery code and here we have write dollar with selector hash search with key up event with anonymous function, here search is the end of search text box. In this function we have write search table function with one argument, in argument we have write dollar this dot value method, we will make the search table function and by using this selector we will get the value of search text box and we have use key up event so whenever we have write any character into search text box, then it will call this search table function. This function will search text from employee data HTML table and display only match text from HTML table. Now we have defined search table function so for this we have write function with name search table with one argument like value. This way we have defined function. Under this function we have write dollar with jQuery selector like hash employee table with table row dot each method with anonymous function. Here employee table is the id of HTML table and this code will check all table row one by one and search text from this table row. After this we have write variable found is equal to false, we will change this found variable value to true, if we have found any match text from HTML table. Then after we have write dollar this selector with each method with anonymous, this code check table data for each table row one by one. So before each method check all table row one by one and after this each method check all data of table data tag of each table row. So now we can easily access the text of each table row's table data tag. So in this function we have write if statement with condition. In condition we have write dollar this selector dot text function dot to lowercase function dot index a function with one argument and in this function argument we have write value dot to lowercase function greater than equal to zero. Here in this code, first we have get text of each table data by using text function and with help of to lowercase function we have convert the text of table data tag to lowercase and index of function is used for search the character from table data text. So this function is used for search character from table data string. In index of function we have write value dot to lowercase function. Here we have get the value from function argument and we have called this function under search text box key up event so whenever we have write search query then this function will receive text box value and this this function will search character from table data tag. If text box type character is find from table data text then will execute if block of code. So in this block we have write found variable is equal to true. So when found variable has true value that means search query data is fine under this table, so we want to show table row and under height other table row. 
So for this first we have this table data each method and write code under table row each method and here we have write if statement with condition like found variable is equal to true then we have write dollar this selector dot show method. Here this condition will check, if found variable value is true then it will execute dollar this dot show. Here this is the current table row and by using show method we can display this table row on web page. But suppose found variable is not equal to true, then it will execute else block of code and in this block we have write dollar this dot hide method, here from this selector we can get the current table row and by using hide method we can hide this table row in HTML table. So this way this code will work. Table row show hide is based on the value of found variable and found variable value is based on search query character is available in HTML table table data. If it is available then found variable will be true and if it not available then found variable value will be false. So friends we have check output in browser. Friends you can see that when we have type any character then at that time we have get the filtered data from HTML table based on which character we have type. This type of functionality is very useful into our web application. This is because for filtered data from HTML we have not execute any server side code for filtered data and all things we have done on web page. We have write simple jQuery code which search character from HTML table and jQuery code check if match text has been found from table then it will show only that table row and hide other table row. So friends if you like this video tutorial, please share this video with your friends or even you can also share on social media also. Friends you want to get more update of my video, so, friends you can subscribe my YouTube channel. Friends you can also like my Facebook page also or you can also follow Webs Listen on Twitter.